What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with Zero. Welcome to episode 39 of our... 39 of our Pokemon Let's Go playthrough. In the last episode, we explored through the Pokemon Mansion and did all the stuff in there. Today, we're going to be taking on the 7th Gym, uh, Blaine, the 7th Gym, and I've heard some good things about it. I haven't heard too much. I just heard that a lot of people like it as the best redesigned gym, so we're taking that on today. If you're excited for more Let's Go, you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up down below, make sure you're subscribed, and let's get to it. Yeah. Let's get to it. Alright. So. Let's see what this is all about. Yo, champ in the making. This gym is... Here we go. Ugh, wait. Should I assume that this is the... Should I assume that this is him? Huh. Here we go. First question. Well, wait, Mr. Blaine. It's not your turn yet. Oh, that's right. Er, the old man you just saw here was the gym leader, Blaine. He's a fire-type Pokemon pro. You did well finding the secret key to get in here, so I think you're ready to take on this gym. As you might have guessed, you'll have to take on a quiz at this gym as well as battles. Try to have a good time. Whoa, hold on. What's going on here? Blaine's always thinking up ways to keep the families of the scientists who live here from getting bored. Whoa, what's going on? Blaine's not very good as an Aki. An M M M C M C. I've never seen M C writ out written out before. But he's red hot when it comes to battles. There's not too much to get excited about here on Cinnabar Island. Whoa! I look forward to more heated battles and sizzling quiz questions. Do you think there are any other fire type leaders out there? Wait, can I not get? Are these just NPCs I can't talk to? Are they just playing so funny? Okay. Good luck out there, trainer. I'm not a trainer, but I still enjoy watching Blaine. That's weird that there are people I just can't talk to. All right, well, let's talk to Blaine. <clears throat> what do you say? You ready to start? No need to be shy, then. Step right up. Here we go. This is Cinnabar Island's gym Pokemon quiz. Challengers get asked five questions that they have to answer. Get one right, and you get a Blaine doll. Get a question wrong, you have to battle one of my students here. But if you manage to beat them, then don't worry, you still get a Blaine doll. Think you can collect five Blaine dolls? Here we go, first question. Quiz time! Which is the Spitfire Pokemon? It is Magmar! But I'm gonna click Growlithe. The challenge has been given his response, and the final judgment is... Sorry, bad call. Too bad, you were close, but ultimately wrong. The challenger must now face a penalty mask against one of the trainers I instruct. Do you know how hot Pokemon fire breath can get? <laughs> Alright, I kinda I kinda like this. I kinda like this gym. This is a cool little This is a cool little reimagine of it. I see what they're doing. Blaine is Blaine is very fresh with it. Blaine is very fresh with it. I like how there are no, there's no requirements to get into this gym. The last gyms you had to be, you had to have 50 Pokemon caught, and you had to have at least a level 45 Pokemon. I guess it just assumes that if you have Surf, that you'll have bo you'll have enough to be able to get here. I guess that makes sense. A hard one, Victor. You've won a Blaine doll. All right, let's move on to the second question. How many gym badges are certified by the Pokemon League are there? I'm going to say seven. The answer is eight, by the way. Sorry, bad call. Too bad. You are close, but ultimately wrong. I used to be a thief, but I went straight. Can I get a shiny? Oh, wait. This is a Magnemite I already clipped on. Magmar? Nine tails. Can I get a, a shiny Magnemite in Pokemon Go? That would be nice. Waterfall! <sighs> Did five. I'm telling you, we've got to train up. 
We've got to get Atlantis accustomed to how we do things. Rock level 55. Just wiling out here. A hard won victory. You've won a Blaine doll. We're not done yet. The second question. Hold on, Mr. Blaine. This is the third question. Third question. Quiz time. A steel type move used on a fairy type will be super effective. Not very effective is the answer. Sorry, bad call. I'm going to go through all of his trainers. I'm training. Do you know why Blaine became a trainer? I don't get this. They're just like standing back there with their random like one line that they're supposed to say if they appear. Also, they all only have one Pokemon each. And I bet one of them is going to have a... What fire type? We haven't seen Arcanine yet. We haven't seen Arcanine just yet. And we haven't seen... What other fire types? We haven't seen a Flareon yet. We haven't seen a Rapidash yet. I don't think. Oh, I'm just skipping over some of this text and I... <sighs> On to the fourth question. TM828 contains the move Tombstony. What's that? Oh no! Oh no! Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Tell me, who are you about to battle? Uh... Old guy in sunglasses. Hot-headed quiz master. Hot-headed quiz master. Wait, what do you mean I'm correct? <laughs> sure. Okay, Blaine, what are you doing? Trainer, you have obtained five Poké Doll or five Blaine dolls, which means it's time for our battle. I'm Blaine, the Red Hot Gym Leader here. My fiery Pokemon are all rough and ready with intense heat. They incinerate all challengers. Ha! Hope you brought some burn heals. All right, Blaine. Sure, bro. You got it. Whoa! His he literally had flame in his eyes. That was crazy. Hit him with that waterfall. Nah, I know Atlantis. I know Atlantis does not get confused. At least not on the first turn. I don't know about the second turn. But I know on the first turn, he does not get confused. Now I might switch. I might let him, sh I might, I might let us share the stage a little bit. Arcanine. I'm gonna go into Brock. Just to reset this confusion, because I don't wanna I don't wanna be stuck in a confusion thing. I don't wanna be stuck in confusion. Earthquake! Ooh, you have outrage. That's a little not scary at all. Oh, that didn't even do half. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ooh, almost. Almost took him out. Do you have heals? I don't, I don't necessarily like that the gym leaders don't have healing items. But then I guess it was pretty predictable what they would do. They would get down in the red and then they would heal and then it would just it would just be the same thing. But that would force you to have to heal. And you could have some strategy in that. You could predict their heal and heal with them and all that stuff. Atlantis grows to 54, wants to learn leech life. X scissor is 80 and 100. Leech life is 80 and 100. But I'm going to go with leech life. I give up X Scissor. Because Leech Life heals, and I love the new Leech Life. That's now two Pokemon on our team that have Leech Life. About to send out Rapidash. Alright, well, we're gonna switch back to Atlantis.
Lair Blitz. <laughs> Did nothing. Hey, don't worry. That means you're not going to take very much recoil damage. Don't even worry about it. I didn't realize how quick this episode was going. We took on three trainers. And Blaine is an absolute pushover. Goodness gracious, Blaine's a pushover. Ooh, Fire Blast. The first time we had seen a Fire Blast, but I literally just O-code everyone. I just O-code everyone in this gym, except the uh, Arcanine. I have burned down to nothing, not even ashes remain. Well, that's sad. You have earned a Volcano Badge. Yeah. And have this TM2 Fire Blast. Vulpix or Charmeleon would be ideal. Fire Blast and attack to be shown the utmost respect. Don't waste on water type Pokemon. Wow. Okay, and just like that. For seventh. Ah, so this is where you were. I thought you might have made your way to Cinnabar Island by now. Did you beat Blaine? Really? Congratulations. You need to have eight gym badges to get into the Pokemon League, right? I've got seven already, which means that the only one left is... Yeah, it must be the Viridian City Gym, right? It was closed up last time I checked, though. Have you been in the Viridian City Gym yet, Domino? You haven't, right? I guess I'll try stopping by Viridian City one more time. Oh, Eevee! So happy over the wind that it's laughing. Yeah, I'd be laughing too. And, uh... Our boy Atlantis is probably laughing as well. Because he just O-code everyone in that gym. Everyone. That's crazy. If you're wondering what I'm looking at, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, I'm sad. Hold on. Okay, there. Now there's nothing to look at. <sighs> All right, let's let's do the thing. But we're gonna go the slowish route because I don't know if anything special is gonna happen once we get there or something. I say slow-ish because I could make it there in about eight seconds, but instead it's probably gonna take me like a minute to get there. Because I saw him run off this way. We battle. I think we battled everybody. Dang, we didn't run into. We didn't see any encounters there. Wow, this brings back memories. It feels like forever since we were here. We've done so much since we came through here. Good job, Atlantis. Thank you for the raspberry. I, I appreciate it very much. Actually, you know what? The last time we were here, we couldn't come this way. So there was a tree I was skipping. I knew I was forgetting a tree. Hmm? Well, it must have dozed off in the sun. I had this weird dream. A lost spirit became a flame and was floating around. Huh? Seems I picked this TM without realizing it. What is going on right now? Eek, that's creepy. I better give it to you. That used to be... Didn't he used to give rest? Did I heal or did I dream that? Did heal. Alright. Uh... Do we do the double? I mean, we've only, we've only had 15 minutes so far. Do we do the double? <gasps> nope. Uh, yes. We do. Yes, we do. Huh, why is the door locked? 
Open sesame. Hmm, yeah, I guess it isn't gonna work. Man. Oh, hey, Domino. She say something if you're standing there. Watching me act all embarrassing like that. Well, never mind. So how many gym badges you got these days? S seven? And it looks like we're even. All that's left now is the Viridian City Gym. Same for you, right? This place is never open. I guess we've got to tell someone that we haven't been able to get into the gym. But who should we talk to? How about the old man? What? Me? I don't know anything about anything like that. Uh, of course you wouldn't. Sorry about that. We'll think it over ourselves. Uh, Jet. Uh-huh, uh-huh, makes sense. If I could understand anything you said, this is getting us nowhere. We could ask Oak. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Let's go see if he knows anything. Oh, really? Whoa. What's going on here? Oh, if it isn't Domino and... <sighs> My name is Oak. My name is Oak. Oh, if it isn't Domino and Checkers. You two are both looking a lot more grown up than the last time I saw you. And you have impeccable timing as usual. Let me introduce you. This is my grandson. Uh, what was his name now? Gramps, no one ever laughs at that joke. Would you give it a break? And besides, we've already met. My own grandson. You're no fun. Yeah, yeah, sure, Gramps. More important than that, though. Domino, checkers, you two did awesome. Huh? With Team Rocket. I never thought that their boss would actually be holed up here at Silphco. And, and the two of you managed to take him down. No, it wasn't me. Domino beat Giovanni all by himself. All I did was help out a bit. So what? You and your Pokemon did your best too, right, Checkers? So I've got a little something for you two as a reward for your hard work. Got a keystone. Oh, is that a keystone? A stone that can trigger an evolution that transcends all other evolutions. Mega evolution. Me mega evolution? What's that? If you both have a Keystone and the right Mega Stone, you can make a Pokemon Mega Evolve in battle. Just one time per battle, though. Your Pokemon will get all powered up to battle hard for you. Mega Evolution is proof of the strong bond between a Pokemon and its trainer. Ahem, a brief poem, if I may. When the two stones are held, when two hearts become as one, we Mega Evolve. The two of you should be able to use these well. These are Mega Stones. So you just assume that I have one of those? You're gonna take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Give these a try when you do. Mega Evolution? Man, if Team Rocket to use a thing like that, they'd have been an even bigger pain. I don't think my team has any... Yeah, we don't have any Megas. Oh, but what are you even doing back in Palatown? What? Viridian City's gym leader's never at the gym? Huh, that's odd. Maybe I'll go take a look myself. Did I just do Oak's voice mixed with it? Oh, this I'm, I'm, I, I am Oak. This is Oak. You two are so close to the Pokemon League now. Just one last push. Okay, well, you know what we're going to do? We're going to wrap up. Right here, standing in, in, in the midst of all these people. We're going to wrap up today's episode. That was exactly what I needed to cover the end of this episode. Next episode, we take on the final gym in Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. If you enjoyed our seventh gym battle against Blaine, hit the thumbs up down below. Make sure you subscribe. And uh, thank you for checking out our video. We'll see you in the next episode. Until then, have a blessed day.